Let me find that story. You see it, Mo? Oh, Baby, Craig, just give us why I'm going to look for the situation. Okay, so there was a white guy. This is, um, I believe it's in, I want to say it was Tennessee. I could be wrong. You could correct me if I'm wrong. It was a white guy who took some of his black friends to a, a restaurant. And the owner is a white man. And he, he said to the white guy, you, you okay with bringing these niggas in here? And the white guy who brought his black friends in went off. You see it, Mo? Let me see. Oh, here it is. Come on, call the police. Please, we need a report. Please, call it. Oh, we need a report. You called us some niggas you called us the police? Come on, Ken. Hey, you messed up, man. No, I didn't mess up. Yeah, you did. Because no. this is their first time experience and they're friends of mine here. That was and then not, you want to make me feel bad that for, was because I sat the, down at the table that was and then not, you ask me, you ask me hmm. if I'm going to consult with these N-I-G-G-E-R-S. No, no. Yeah, Bullshit. that's exactly what you said. You, Every one of them heard it. No, they did not. Yes, they did. They, was all they, they did. And then when I got pissed off and you no. knew I was pissed, you went and hide behind the bushes. No. I, and I walked right around there and couldn't find you. That's not right. I'm right this here. is their first time I here, Greg. Right that was. I was just bragging. Ask everyone. Yeah. I was bragging how good it was to come, come here. But if and they wanted come to come back until back. you showed your ass out here and had a problem with race. Today is my son's 22nd birthday. He had to encounter this. Really? That's not yeah. right. You, you should be ashamed of yourself, man. Yeah, you no. So you know what? We're not going to have anything else to say. We're not causing problems. We're, I'm making my point to you. These are my friends. I've known him a long time. Our first time down and here, and he called all this a nigger. And when I come out, you confront me for talking to him. No, man, we're not leaving you say, so you condone this? That's what you asked me. You condone, you condone the blacks? Ain't no condone about it. They're my friends. They're just like us. You just didn't want them in there. And I'm not for that. And you know what? As far as I'm concerned, everybody that eats in here that I know will probably never be back. Oh, this is going live. I'm posting all of this. Thank you, Mr. Thank you. I apologize. I apologize y'all's first night. You can't fix stupid, sir. You cannot. I apologize. Hey, just stop. I apologize. Anthony to see or whatever. Y'all my friends, and I'm not I'm not going for that. Just tell me what was said when you walked out. When I walked out, he jumped all over me and said, so you condone sitting at the table with the N-I-G-G-E-R-S? Yeah, thank you. Yeah. That's how you show up as an ally. Right. Right, exactly. So that, thank you for correcting me too. That's Tuscaloosa, Alabama. Oh, it's It's in Tuscaloosa. And I believe the restaurant, what is it called? Nick and Stitch? Let me look it up. And the best part about it is that no, no, nobody that was black had to say a word. At that all. That was the best part about it. That's nobody right. Nobody black had to say a word. So Tuscaloosa. And anybody visiting Tuscaloosa, go and eat anywhere other than that place. <laughs> and if you live there, boycott it. <laughs> right. That part. That's how you do, though. You 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 respond by divesting. From a business, you don't you don't support that. You don't you don't support a business. You pull your money from it. Those yeah. of you that are driving these Teslas, those of you that are in a market for a Tesla, you already know what the corporate culture is over mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. Burn it to the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. But the way that you really get real, um, you affect real change is by divesting. Yes. That's how you do it. You know what I mean? And so uh, we had talked earlier about uh, Elon Musk using AI technology to create video of Kamala Harris saying things that she didn't really say. You know, my thing with that is and I, and I saw that post the other day and I commented and said, and yet there are so many black folks that are still purchasing Teslas and you think that's a real flex because you're driving around in a Tesla. 
And then there were people, people in the comments who were saying, yeah, but what about all of the other companies or car companies that are racist? But bitch, I don't know it. Yeah. <laughs> this person is openly like overtly. Yeah. Nah, no shade, girl. We still listen, we tell Chick-fil-A up. And you know they don't like the fag. That's true. That's, I don't need that's over true. There. Girl, where you start eating Chick Fil A when I bought you that chip? bitch? You was Girl, just, I don't eat you meat. Was just get, you was just for to get more milkshake from over there. I was just talking. <laughs> I was just talking. So I'm not getting my milkshake. Not at all. I, I can give you a milkshake. <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. Do I not be a, messy. I, I got do a milkshake. Be, Look, do I not. <laughs> Cookies Do not and, be messy, I, I Craig. No, please. don't be messy, Craig. Cookies and cream. Got right. <laughs> I, got, I got a milkshake for you. All, it'll bring all to the yard. All the boys all to the yard. All of them. Not <laughs> some. Not all the ones. <laughs> even even the ones from Africa. Don't do that. Don't be like that. Why y'all mess? Why y'all such a mess? <laughs> oh, I got a milkshake for you. What kind you like? Uh, two liters. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I put a little topping on it too. Let me tell you something. It's no, I'm lactose intolerant. It's a different world. Don't worry about it. I'm lactose intolerant. Hey! <laughs> love me. Before I heard them say, it's a different world. Who, from where you come from? Yes, he do know, yeah. He's my face to me. Come out, Aretha. Ah. Come out, Aretha, come out. She said this right here. Yeah, yeah, that's true. remember that a human soul. Oh, it's a different world. A different world. Hey, from where you come from? Yeah, from where you come from? Yes, God. Listen, you get over there. You get over here in this different world if you want to. <laughs> You'll be saying that all day. Y'all a miss. Let me tell you something. Y'all a miss. Since we in the realm of singers, yes, indeed. Brandy's Brandy's daughter rung me up. Sarah. Her name is Sarah. Sarah rang me up, girl. She sure oh, did. Girl. She sure did. She rang her up. Yo, you be saying Brandy. Uh. I do not tell Brandy. I just, I just, <laughs> vocal Bible, no. So what do you give her? Notebook. Take notes. Well, see, this, see, this is why I have to come back. See. <laughs> I didn't say that Brandy can't sing. Brandy is, an, Brandy is a beast singing. Bitch, it's so many. Ha, 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 ha. The voice control is um, is is amazing. I can't. Y'all saw y'all saw that comment down there. I can't sing. I can't. But that's not your profession either. But I can listen. I do have ears. I can hear. And again, uh -huh. what I said about her mother was that her mother is an exceptional singer. You said she she a is a beast at singing. Her harmonies are bitch top tier. Yeah, yeah. Bitch, the way that she can lay and stack a motherfucking vocal is, is not to be tampered with. It is not. But the Bible, I'm not doing it. The Bible for me is basic instructions before leaving earth. I'm not stopping my brain. I'm also an older girl. So for me, when you talk about Bible, you, I'm going to say somewhere in the Whitney range. And yes, that was Whitney's daughter. Mm -hmm. That was. But I'm not, I didn't take away from her vocal ability. I didn't take away from it because I, cause I can't because the woman is, is amazing, bitch. And, and bitch, and bitch it, I've seen her eat countless times. Bitch, I sat in the studio with that lady. Great. And the girl is bad. I'm not even going to hold you. In the name. In the name. Her ear, 
is but impeccable. What we are not going to sit up here is like you're not like I'm not forcing y'all to, to say I'm a real woman. You're not going to force me, force me, and that is my opinion <laughs> about that. That's it. And when I said take notes, I was saying that people come and they take notes from her. I wasn't saying that Brandy need to take notes from nobody. Bitch, I was saying people come to take notes from that woman. That woman is bitch. But as me and my, I'm from a different era. Right. I'm from a different era. And so I'm, I I didn't, I don't understand. I don't see what y'all said or why I said no book. Okay, so y'all don't like me saying notebook. All right, well, it's, it's a scripture, a chapter. Not in the Bible. Yes, a chapter, a, 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 somewhere in the middle. Oh, New Testament. <laughs> New Testament. Because you listen to that song last night. That Murder. I listen. This bitch. I have a brandy playlist. Yeah, we fuck with brandy. This to the ground. I have a brandy playlist. I have never, I have not said any, not to you. How am I pulling the trans card? What? That must have been another story. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that might have been. I don't yeah, know y'all did. Y'all got to catch up. <laughs> y'all got to catch up, honey. Don't relish in that. Catch up. Right. So I don't get where y'all, we going with the thing and like, I, like they were still dragging me on my back. Girl. But bitch, I'm too big. Y'all put y'all on <laughs> <laughs> I'm too big. Wait, put your why arm, can't they drag you? I'm too big. Put your arms down. My back too wide, bitch. My back can take a lesson and keep going. <laughs> bitch, you don't see these motherfucking tire marks on me, bitch. I walk the streets. <laughs> I walk the streets, bitch. There are tire marks and motherfucking goddamn uh, wounds all over me, bitch. I'm, I'm not going down. So, yes, when I saw that, I was like, daughter, I didn't say I I would I didn't say anything disparaging about your mother. Nothing. I mean, and I get it. That's her mama. So of course she's uh, gonna yeah, go for it. She's right, gonna right, go for because I'm right. going for it by mine. And I'm going for it by mine, bitch. <laughs> so I'm going for it by my mama. So, but yeah. I, but if I if I see a person saying, "Oh, child, that bitch can't do," because it was none of that. Even in this, I gave because that's how I feel. And again, biblical. When you talk biblical to me, bitch, I, I take that shit serious. Yeah, I do. The Trinity for me is who I said is the Trinity, and like after that, I don't go no beyond that. Whitney, Whitney, Whitney and Whitney, but it's Whitney, <laughs> Mariah, and Celine. That's the Trinity for me. I'll, for that's you, just the. No. I don't go beyond that. All the other stuff that's great that the, everybody's saying that this is this and that. Good. <laughs> I don't go beyond that. Why are you down I mean, here? <laughs> why are you down here? No, I, I do love Brandy. I will say I love Brandy. And um, and I don't get into the whole who's better and the, you know, because I think yeah. I think everybody has their gift. And she definitely is gifted. And somebody asked in the comment, what was it like in the studio? That lady was sitting on a stool, tearing it up, singing. Yes. And you know, most people who know anything about singing will tell you that when you're it's singing, hard. Hard. you should be standing up so that your hold diaphragm... On, somebody said, hold on, you can't come on our show and tell us when to retire conversation. Uh, we can talk about what we want, when we want, how we want to, and how, how, how forever long. <laughs> you have the option to leave. <laughs> you, you have the option to leave. You don't have to be here. <laughs> this is this is a story that pertained to me, so it's, my, it's our show, <laughs> and I was talked about on another platform. And I was addressed by the who I was talking about. And I'm talking about if you don't like the conversation, you, you can leave this section and come back. And if we're still and if we're still here talking about that, you don't have to return. <laughs> don't listen, don't don't stress yourself. Don't stress yourself because we're not stressed. Don't stress yourself. Okay, thanks. But Brandy's tone, her tone, her pitch. Her breath control, all of that, it's just, it's just something about the way that lady lays a vocal, the way she stacks a vocal. Yes. And like I said, she was sitting. Broken hearted. Yeah.
Bitch, and broken hearted, angel in disguise, full yeah. moon, bitch, yeah. Afro, Afro DJ is my number one. Yeah. Bitch, that's my number one. Bitch, that's my go to, bitch. When I want, when I want to get painted, bitches, bitches, Afro DJ. Yeah. And when I want to get double Dutch painted, yeah. I ain't even gonna lie. When I bought them in the club, I don't hear them do that. I don't like a little dude. And I don't get your life. You can dance if you want. But I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, she bad. But I, I did get into it with her mama. When I went out there to work with her, that, that that story is in the first book. Now, what you did with Miss Sonya? Don't do Miss Sonya because no, I like Miss me. Oh, I like Miss Sonya. Don't do Miss Sonya. No, it wasn't that. It wasn't, it wasn't about the gay thing. Don't do Miss Sonya. Uh, but Brandy, this was around the time she was dating the guy Q. You remember the basketball player? The basketball player that she was dating. Yep. And um, this was after him. And so Brandy and I, we met at a wedding. Long story short. I went to LA to work with her. Brandy and I were cool, but Brandy, her mom was her manager at the time. Because remember, she left her mom for a while. Benny Medina was manager, and then she went back to her mom. Well, when she brought me out to LA, obviously they were paying for the hotel and all of that. And her mama didn't know why I was there. Like her mother thought I was just a friend just coming to hang out. I said, girl, no, I don't hang out. I'm coming to work. To write, uh, right, almost, almost doesn't, doesn't count. count. <laughs> almost made you love me. Almost made you cry. Everybody knows. Almost doesn't count. Ooh, I can't keep on. I hear. Never, never really sure. People loving me, one foot outside the door. And all that I can give you is what you came here for. I'm gonna find me somebody. Bitch! <laughs> bye bye. Don't play with me. So, her mother, I live for this thing. Her mother was like, well, well, why are you here? I said, What do you mean, why am I here? Did you not talk to Brandy? She said, well, we're paying for it. I said, well, I'm, I'm aware of that. But Brandy didn't communicate to her mom that I was there to work on songs. And so we just kind of bumped heads. And then later, I bumped heads with Brandy. We bumped heads, too, because I don't give a fuck. Right. So, um, but anyway, but, I, but regardless, I still think she's very talented. Miss Sickney. Yeah. And, um, and I'm not going to keep going through this shit no more. Yeah.